On a night where there's been a lot of bad news to report, we wanted to close with a reminder that there are stories of hope and inspiration out there. This one is about a young girl named Amanda Bozlowski. Just eight years old, Amanda has been raising money for the Heart and Stroke Foundation for some time now. So much money, she's attracted the attention of billionaire Donald Trump. How did she do it? Let's just say she took some lemons and made lemonade. CTV's Ravi Beshwal has tonight's success story. Would you like sugar-free um, sugar or not sugar-free? At 25 cents a glass, since she was eating out of a high chair, year in and year out, Amanda Bezloski has raised more money for the Heart and Stroke Foundation. But you need the money, right? Yeah. Okay. Amanda's lemonade stand has put more than $45,000 in the kitty to fight Canada's number one killer something which shook her grandparents. They all, both have artificial valves, so so I decided to raise money. Would you like a cookie? You're welcome. Whoa. She's received kudos from politicians and a guy who knows a little something about selling. That's a lot of lemonade when you think about it, $50,000 at that age, eight years old. Well, she did a lot better than I did at eight years old. Amanda is not alone in her early and personal interest in charity and fundraising. In fact, there's a new philanthropic awareness among Canada's youth. Craig Kielberger's fight against child labor, Hannah Taylor's pleas for the homeless, Bijal Rajan's support of South Asian tsunami victims, Next. all part of a spike that the National Survey of Giving, Volunteering and Participating says has been going on with youth since 1998. That's a very encouraging sign for us because our research shows that if we get children involved at an early age, they're likely to be engaged in these causes throughout their life. Amanda Bezloski is on the front lines of that new Canadian reality. She wants to prove young people can do big things. It made me feel like I was doing the best thing in the entire world. Ravi Bechwal, CTV News, Toronto. And that is CTV News for this Wednesday, August 31st.